Hello, I'm going to show you how to install the Black Ops 2 team. First of all, make sure you have Nova Launcher on your phone or Apex Launcher or any launcher that supports custom grids. Go into Nova Settings, Desktop, Desktop, oh, Desktop Grid 7x4. You need this. Without it, it's not gonna work. So make sure you have 7 by 4 with margin non height margin small. Search bar off. Um, scroll effect. Make sure you use cube. You can use none, but I think the cube one looks better. Uh, the cube scroll effect is uh, present in the free version of Nova Launcher, if I'm not mistaken. Disable the dock and disable the notification bar so you will get a clean home screen. Now, next step make sure you install a black wallpaper. I have an option for no wallpaper. If you don't have it, just download a black wallpaper and set it. Now we're going to add the widgets. Going to UCCW 4x2. Here you will see a list of all the Black Ops 2 widgets you need. You will see it's categorized page 1, page 2, page 3, page 4 first one is page one bottom and you can see what it actually is it's the phone widget kind of next you add a three by three widget for mid right this is the only tricky part because most widgets are four by one or 4x2 this one is 1x2 one it's this one no, I said it in the wrong place <laughs> 4x2 top one the clock so you're gonna do this with all four pages and you're gonna get this result this is page 2 page 3 and page 4 and this is the main page page. so you're gonna have your phone internet uh, battery life temperature settings clock that kind of important stuff on your main page Social stuff, email, Gmail, Facebook, Skype, SMS, music, gallery, camera, that kind of stuff. Um, I have two versions for this widget. One is uh, linked to Google Play Music and one is linked to Power Amp. So if you use Power Amp, use the Power Amp version. If you use Google Play Music, use the Google Play Music version. If you use another music player, like the HTC Music Player, it's not going to do anything because I don't have the HTC Music Player on my Galaxy S3 and I could only connect it to the apps I have. So, just going to show you that there are two 4x1. This is page 3, Google Play music version and Power Amp. So I use Power Amp, I choose that one, and when I press play music, it opens Power Amp. You can press the time on the first page, go into the alarm, um, press internet to go into Google Chrome, um, press the date here to go into a to make a new event for in a calendar 
Skype, all kind of stuff. You can just look around and find out what every, everything does. This is for Google Calendar, so make sure you have Google Calendar on your phone. I can't connect it to any apps I don't have, so if you have the HTC Calendar, it's not going to open that. So you can just download the Google Calendar for free from the market. The app drawer isn't actually part of any widget, this is a black space. Um, you can just add the app drawer icon there by long pressing it. I will show you how to do that. Long press Nova Actions App Drawer. That's the way you can set the app drawer there. You can make your own app drawer icon. That's what I did. Gallery. And then just pick the icon you want or you can leave it like this how you want it you can uh, play around I mean if you don't want uh, the time on your first page but you want um, let's say I don't know maps you can of course put maps there I just gave an idea of where everybody everything should go the way I made it but you can of course switch it around if the list is empty when you add widgets so let's say you're adding a widget and there is nothing in this list that means you're probably running Android 4.1 and there is a problem with Android 4.1 it sometimes doesn't show team apps the thing is if you get this problem and you're running Android 4.1 the simple fix is to download titanium backup backup this app and then restore the app and after that they should show up in the list but I don't think a lot of people will have this problem, so just in case. If you don't know how to do it, um, just email me. But I think this video should be clear enough. Thank you for watching.